In the last video, we took a closer look at the different features within each of the conversations tabs within your channels of your team. I want to focus in on one specific feature and that is the paperclip feature, which allows you to attach a file right within a conversation. I could be having a conversation and at mentioning a member of my team, such as Danny Moss or John Ned, and I could share a specific file with them. Let's upload a file from my computer. Notice before I do that, that I do have access to grab files from my OneDrive. I could even browse other teams that I belong to and other channels that I belong to for files. Or I could take a look at recent files that I've been working on within Teams. But as I mentioned, I'm going to grab a file from my computer. So I'm going to share this Flipgrid training document. Notice that it is a Microsoft Word document. You can also share PowerPoint, um, PDFs, and Excel documents. And uh, again, if I wanted to direct this towards a specific individual of the team, I could always start typing the at symbol and I could select a member of the team or I can just leave that blank and it will be directed to the entire team. I can add a message or I can simply just click the purple airplane icon or send icon to post my file. Now, here's the cool thing. I can actually collaborate on this file right within Teams. So I can click on this file now that it's been posted to the Conversations tab. And that file will open in Microsoft Teams. And I can always go ahead and click Edit here at the top and notice that Word Online opens and that file opens in Word Online. Now to the far right here, what you're seeing is a chat window. I can hide the conversation by clicking on the little chat icon here in the top right, or I can show the conversation. By showing the conversation, I can now have a conversation with others from my team whom I may be editing this document with. Notice at the very bottom of that chat window, I have all the same tools that I have in the conversations tab, including the ability to enhance my message with emojis, GIFs or GIFs, and stickers. So I could go ahead and add a comment and hit enter on my keyboard to post that comment or click the purple airplane send icon to post that comment. Let's close out of this. One thing to keep in mind is that any edits you make to documents right within Teams automatically save. So there is no save button to click, you just simply click close. One of the things I want you to notice in the conversation stream is that comment that I made in the side chat was added to my post about that particular document. And if anyone replied, I would see their replies underneath. Please keep in mind that any files or documents that you or your team members add to the Conversations tab are also saved here in the Files tab or the File Storage area inside that particular channel that you are working in. You can also collaborate on files here within the Files tab, and we'll take a closer look at that in a future video.